speaking for the city council also. In the, the poetry department. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he you said. Got a poem for the occasion? He said you right here. You got words? He said. Where we hope he'll stay as permanent resident here every day. Now, therefore, I, Richard. Now, George Foreman says that he got a quick count. I don't know. I think they would have to play it over and look at it, and you could tell. But I think everybody saw that he was soundly beaten until the knockdown. Uh, the knockdown really shook him, and I think that the people realized that if he'd gotten up, uh, he'd be still in danger. And most likely, I would have knocked him down again. And he was really getting tired, and we had nine more rounds to go, and I wasn't tired. And I think the people know that... Uh, I soundly won the fight, and there wasn't nothing fast involved. What are you going to do now, Mohammed? Well, I'm just going to rest a while and enjoy the title and the name of the champion since I've been off so long, and then I'll make a decision late, later, but I'm sure I'm going to retire. But uh, if I do any more fighting, it will be because the Honorable Elijah Muhammad, our leader, is trying to build a hospital on the south side, which is something badly needed for black our people. Yeah, and we'd if like I to see fight, a, it'll only be for a good cause. Okay, we we'd like, we like to see a fight here in Chicago. I love to. This we is a fight go. city.